Hi, and welcome to Lesson 4 Homework. This is Module 5 of Grade 2. Please write your name here first before you start doing the math. And we're just doing more Arrowway. This is, uh, really, Arrowway is just a way to write down the steps you do in your head for mental math. So that means we're writing it down. So Arrowway we have to write down. 430 now we're doing we've been doing a lot of addition with the airway now it looks like we're doing a lot of subtraction so 430 and we can subtract all 200 at once that's our arrow and that makes 230 and 430 minus 200 is 230 and then we subtract the 30 minus 30 is 200 and that's just how you would do it in your head subtract the hundreds first and then subtract the tens and you can see oh that's all the tens you just left with 200 430 minus 200 we're going to subtract 240 this time so that's subtracting we have 230 now we're subtracting 40 it's easier to subtract the 30 first and then 10 more so just like we already did minus 30 gets us the 200 and then it's easier to subtract 10 from 200 and try to do this all at once 190 and mentally you might just think oh okay so that's going to be 200 and then 10 subtract 10 more 190 Um, 570 minus 300 is our arrow, 270, and then 570 minus 300, 270, but now we're subtracting the 70 also, so minus 70, 200. And these are the this these are the steps that you would use really. If you're going to subtract this in the beginning, you might start thinking about subtracting the 300 first, then subtract the 70, and then subtract the 20 more. Just these are the very steps we're just practicing them. 270, and then I subtract the 70, so I can only have 200. So I get down to just exactly 200 left but now I have to subtract 20 more because 90 isn't I'm subtracting 390 not 370 so I have to subtract 20 more and it's easy to subtract from hundreds because we know we're thinking about our partners to 10 we're taking 80 from 100 we're gonna 20 from 100 we're gonna have an 80 left for our tens 750 Minus 400, 350, 750, minus 400, 350, just like before. And now we're going to subtract 50 more because it's 450. And that leaves us with just the 300. And now we're going to subtract 450 and a little bit more than 450. That's, this is going to be 30 more because 80 is 30 more than 50. So we're we going to go with the same thing and then we're going to subtract 30 more when we get to it. 750 whoops, minus 400. Don't forget those operation signs. That gets us to 350. Then we subtract the 50 just so we can get all the way down to the next 100. And then we subtract 30 more, 270, 940, subtract the 300, 640, and then I got to subtract the 30. 40 minus 30 is 10, so it's 610. And now we're subtracting more 10s than we have. So we're, remember what we're going to do. 
Subtract the hundreds first, minus 300, 640. Then we're going to subtract all of the 40, so we can get down to the 600. But we're going to subtract 20 more, because 60 is 20 more, so we have to subtract 20 more. Minus 20, 580. And now we have 940. Now this one, there's a, a way you might do this. It's, I'm going to just, if you look at this, 80, there's kind of two ways to think about this. When you're close to 500, you could subtract 500 and add 200 back. That would really be one of the ways to do it. But just to keep doing it the way we have been, Subtract down to 540. And then we're going to subtract 80 more, right? So we're going to subtract 40 first to get us to 500. And then I'm going to subtract the other 40. So I'm splitting this 80 into 40 and 40. Just so I can do this. 460. Oops. Now, <clears throat> same thing as uh, we did uh, in the previous lesson, except now we're subtracting instead of adding using arrow weight or mental math. And I'm just going to explain my mental math as I go. And I, you can write it down arrow weight 330 minus 200. This one is just looking at the digits, right? We're going to have one of the hundreds left, and we're going to keep that 30, 130. Uh, here we are, we're going to subtract 100, and we're going to subtract the 30. Subtracting two of the hundreds, we'll have 100 left, and we the 30 is all taken away, so we just have the 100 that's left. And now, the, now this is 330 minus 260. We already know what 330 minus 230 is. We know that's 100, and this is 60 more, so we still have to subtract. This is uh, 260, so it's 30 more than 230, so we have to still have to subtract another 30. 70 left. And it's just as we go from left to right, it's the same thing as we were doing going from top to bottom on the first page. So we're looking at this 440 minus 240. Well, it's if we take this menu end right here, we're going to, all of these tens are going to go. And we're just looking at the hundreds, 400 minus 200. We're going to have 200 left. That's really two mental steps. 440 minus 260. Well, we know 440 minus, we know what 440 minus 240 is because we just did it. That's 200, but now we have to subtract 20 more because 260 is 20 more than 240, so we have to subtract another 20 for 180. And now 290 is 30 more than 260, so we know what this is. We just have to subtract 30 more once we finish it. So 440 minus 260 we know is 180 because we just solved it and now we have to subtract 30 more for 150. Eight hundred sixty minus five hundred sixty. Well, you can see we're going to have the sixty. We're going to subtract all of the sixty, so we'll have zero tens left. And eight hundred minus five hundred is three hundred. And now we're going to do the same thing, but we're going to take away five hundred seventy. So that's ten more, right? So we know that that's eight hundred sixty minus. We know what eight hundred sixty minus. 
560. That was 300. And but this is we're subtracting 10 more this time. So subtracting 10 more 290 is going to be left. And now we have 860 minus 590. Oh, uh, mentally, really, I would do it. I would do it this way. I would subtract 600 and add 10 back. Because it's really easy to subtract hundreds like this. I guess 590 is almost 600. So, but it's a little bit less. So the difference is 10. So it's easier to subtract 600, 260, and then add 10 back because I, because subtracting 600 is 10 too much. So I'm going to add 10 back. 270. And now here we can see 970 minus 470. You're going to subtract all the tens, so you won't have any tens left. And you're looking at 900s minus 400s, that's 500 left. And 970 minus, so, so it's the same thing, except now we're subtracting 10 more than we did last time. So it's 970 minus 470, which is 500. And then we subtract 10 more, 490. And now here we have, we could do the same thing and then subtract 10 more, or we could subtract 500 and add 10 back. Either way, it's going to be a two step method. So we could start with the 970. And just for writing, I'll do, I'll subtract the 480, since we already know what that is. That was 490. And then I'm going to subtract 10 more, because 490 is 10 more than 480. 480 is left. And now we're solving, looking just the tens are already here, but this time we have to write down our units. We want, if this is asked, like our expression is given to us in unit form, so we want to write our difference in unit form. 66 tens minus 30 tens, we're just looking at subtracting tens. Right, so that's 36 tens. 66 minus 36, we're going to lose all of those six, right? And then three, we'll just have 30 tens. 66 minus 38. This is trickier because now you can't just look at the digits. They're not the friendly digits where you can just look at the ones and take oh and subtract them. I might think of this as subtracting 40 and adding 2 back instead of taking away 38. But we just did this one, right? B, we just subtracted 36 and we had 30. 38 is subtracting 2 more, so we should have 28 left. And they're tens. But our minuend is different now. We don't have 66 anymore, we have 67, and this is 39. So we're subtracting, if we compare it to C, sorry, it makes it hard to read. If we're comparing it to C, we start with one more, then we're subtracting one more. So the extra one that we started with, we're taking it, we're also taking it away. So if we start with more, we take away more, we end up with the same 28 tens. What's the value of 28 tens? That's 280. And the value of 36 tens, standard form, 360.